Thanks, Carl. Well, topping the news this half hour, as Carl said, is bargain Christmas shopping. Black Friday is underway, but it certainly looks different than it did 10 years ago. Here's what Black Friday crowds looked like a decade ago in Western New York. Now, that was before online shopping became as big as it is now. This is what shopping looked like today at the Walden Galleria. It was still hard to find a parking spot at the mall, but inside it was a steady stream of shoppers. I spoke to a few of them who go to the mall every Black Friday and how they think it's changed. We always start at Walmart, Target, the mall, Five Below, everything in the area. I haven't found any deals. I'm shopping for my four-year-old and nine-year-old and I'm struggling. Really? Yes. Is it, is it normally like that for you? Or? No. But they have everything. They're doing sales at the beginning of the month. Um, you know, and then each week, each day is something different where it's you're not getting up at you know, 5 a.m. to beat, beat the people at the store. Do you like that more or do you wish that it was kind of the big rush? Like I love the rush, the adrenaline. Oh, I love it. So a lot of stores have been closing on Thanksgiving the last couple of years, opening early that next morning instead. I also spoke to the store manager of the perfume stop inside the mall. She says one good thing about this year, it's nice to have Canadians business back after the border had been shut down the last two years. Now coming up on the town hall at 530, Cyber Monday is almost here. A cybersecurity expert will tell us how inflation is playing a role in more shoppers falling for scams this year and how you can avoid them when shopping online. Danielle Church, Channel 2 News.